Good morning, sweetheart. Here I got another interesting watch for you. Uh, today I have Aviator or Aviator, depending how you pronounce it in English or in Russian. Uh, high-tech chronograph watch, so high-end watch uh, from Poljot. I would say high-end, but uh, although Poljot is quite known brand, although it isn't uh, a prestige or luxury in any way. And it's uh, a little bit unfair to them, I would say, because uh, overall Russian watches are, I would say, uh, the most undervalued watches on the watch market. Uh, this watch isn't exactly cheap, because as I said, it is like a premium line of uh, this uh, brand. And this watch new cost uh, between 750 euros and 800 euros, something like that. Uh, and, but when you want to sell it, it will be hard to get even 400 euros for it. Uh, probably you can get 400 euros depending on the client, uh, on, on somebody, if somebody really wants it. Uh, but overall it's hard to find any micro brand watch uh, with a good quality for this kind of money. And here you have very unique design in many ways. Uh, although design is a kind that won't ap be appealing for everybody, there are, there are people that will love it, there are people that will hate it in many ways, And but you have to uh, appreciate or even admire that at least they're trying to do something in their own way. Uh, the most interesting thing about this watch is the dial. Uh, there are many layers uh, of this dial. I will do a close-up for you. As you can see, there is a quite an interesting combination. Uh, indexes are covered with Super Luminova. Uh, movement is a uh, Russian well-known reliable 3133 movement. Uh, this is of course a good thing for me. I like Russian watch. It's supposed to have Russian movement, so this is a good thing. But uh, you have a couple of unique features like multi layers of the dial. This uh, another scale here. Hands are with unique triangle shape. All of this corresponding well with the high tech name of this watch. And, and the purpose uh, of being like a uh, very industrial uh, chronograph. One thing that I don't like about this watch is the thing here. Maybe not don't li I don't like it, but um, I would say that the user of the watch should have a choice. And this part here in the middle isn't removable, it's uh, connected with the case permanently. Uh, so if you want to don't have this metal ending here, you have to buy uh, or uh, to be honest made a strap with a U-type shape uh, for the looks. So uh, it won't be easy, won't be cheap and probably the looks of it could be a bit disappointing. Um, and I think there, they did a not so good job with this and uh, the owner sh uh, should have a choice if he prefer to use those parts or not and I would prefer some uh, regular ending here also. I would say this would incre increase value quite a bit. Um, case itself it has a uh, quite unique shape. This is a good thing about those looks because they are movable so the watch wears extremely comfortable. You can have it like this, you can have it like this, so uh, whatever wrist size you have, it will fit perfectly. This is also a good thing <laughs> about those metal parts, but as I said, uh, owner should have a choice. Back is a solid back. This watch is limited to 350 pieces, but I saw that there are a few different limitations of this watch, for example 300 pieces, and I think each color of the dial has a different uh, limitation. And this, this grayish metallic Sambers dial here have a 350 pieces. Although 
overall case has a very unique shape and it's a mix of combination of polished and, and brushed surfaces. Watch is also perfectly sized. It's 43 millimeters without the crown. Crown is quite small, so it will fit almost every wrist. As I said, these uh, metal endings even make it more comfortable. I would show you how it looks on my 17, 17 and a half centimeter wrist. I would say it looks quite nicely and uh, it has this high-tech feel and I like uh, when the name of the watch is corresponding with it looks. And here you have a perfect example of this kind of situation. So, like it or hate it, it's your choice. I would say that the value that you will get for the price is great. So, that's it. Aviator Hightech Chronograph. Thank you. Bye.